Good. Go. Live from the Firehouse Saloon, Badlands Radio Studio, and 18 Moon, as the legend continues to grow tonight. It is my honor, it's my pleasure, and it's just my downright happiness to welcome in my brother Double D, Daryl Dodge, in the Firehouse Saloon tonight. Daryl! Talk to me, brother. What's, What's up? up? How you doing, Hank Moon? Hey, man, good. Woo. Way too long. I know it's been too long. Way too long. Way too long. Finally, we got you in the firehouse. Man, that's great to be in the firehouse. It's been a long time. I met Tom at Steamboat. We don't know if it was a year ago or two years ago. Mm -hmm. Five years ago. Yeah, it was two. It's two. I think it was. Tom says it's two. And here we are again. And here we are. Mixing misery and gin. Mm -hmm. All right, here we go. All right. <laughs> the creativity's already flowing. It's flowing. How are you, Hank? Hey, man, I'm good, I love brother. You, man. Let's talk about you. I love you too, brother. I love you too, man. All the way from Memphis to Houston. Yes, absolutely. Back, Back into the honky tonks. Back to the honky tonks. 2016. Let's talk about the future, man. We can talk about the legend that is Daryl Dodd. Wow. Well, you know, I think that's just what happens when you get old. They start calling you the legend. Yeah. No, I'm, I'm kidding. But I, I will no, say, you're not. I will really? say that um, that um, it's kind of good to be me lately because. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> a lot of people are uh, saying those kind of things like, man, you remind me of a young, like, you're like the new Gary Stewart. I'm like, I will gladly take that uh, that that place just because when I was a young guy in Gary Stewart in Texas, he, of course, he'd done a lot of things. He was all over the world and made records and stuff, but it just seems like some guys like that have a timing that happens when it happens, when, when the world is ready for, for that and Sometimes it's too early, sometimes it's just right. I think it's just getting just right. Things are fixing to get real good is what I'm trying to say. Ah, see, there you go. <laughs> there you go. You know, Hank, that's how we, That's what we do around here. Right. We put cheese on everything, man. We put <laughs> cheese on everything. Things are, things are fixing to get real good. Yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. Survivor, is that, is that, is that an insult to you? Is that a what? Survivor. Survivor, yes. Yeah, last man standing is what I kind of think anymore. You know, you've been doing this so long, and, and uh, just I've stayed true to myself to a fault, if you want to call it that. I was in Nashville, came back home. In fact, in uh, January I'm going to Nashville. A good friend of mine that I lived in Nashville with and uh, cut records with and wrote songs with had the same mindset as I did. He went away. He's gone back up there, and he built a really nice publishing company that he's introducing in January and I'm going up there to be the special guest singer and it turns out all these young writers and uh, people I knew when I was there it's like now it's a cool thing for me to come back and, and play at this event you know the grand opening for his publishing company and all these young writers are like Daryl Dawes my hero and he and I both were going what <laughs> what, what do you mean <laughs> where did they hear from but you know if, I guess we started out 23 years ago making music and and you never know who's listening and you make it good you make it from the heart and you can't lose with that if you make it from the heart you can't lose brother can't lose. and you always have you don't know any other way right no I don't know any other way you're right right you know you're gonna make you, you can't write a bad song <laughs> well you know I'll admit like when you said you me I'll say that anyone that you yourself included, and I love you, and, I, and you know that because you're, you're from the heart, man. You're from the heart. I'm from the heart. I just prefer to be around those kind of people. We can't always in this business, but that's who I grav gravitate to, and I think likewise to me. And uh, it's the long way around. You can go the quick shiny route, you know. <laughs> never, never could do that. <laughs> you can go the quick shiny route. Yep, just said that. But uh, or you just stay true to yourself and, and see what happens. Real quick, does that define creativity, Daryl Don? You're one of the most creative guys I've ever known. It does, man. It does for me. You know, I'm in the moment, and I, I'm, you know, I'm in. I hear things from, you know, we hear things from everywhere, and uh, <laughs> they come in and like, there's an idea, but they've got to like, it's got to, it's got to mean something. I can't just make up a song for, and I've done that, right? I've made up songs and written songs for people that wanted me to write a song about this. But I prefer it to come from some cosmic place that I've experienced or something that's going to say something. You know, Willie Nelson has written so many great songs and said a lot of great things, but I think he said, you can't write a song if you ain't got something to say, you know. And, uh, 
you know, I just, I was one of those guys that just wanted to mean something. I wanted to enrich people's lives just like myself growing up, hearing great songs that make a different difference. And uh, I'm just one of those people. And, and you have, Daryl Dodd. Well, you have, you. brother. You have guitar in hand. I do. Would you I, enrich our lives here on the Firehouse Saloon YouTube channel? Well, that sounds a little arrogant for me to enrich your it's lives. Not it's, not right. it's not arrogant. It's not arrogant. It's not arrogant. I've been called know. worse. You know, we were just talking about things are fixing to get real good, and uh, I think that's kind of my, is uh, an old song, and it was uh, from the heart. I moved to Nashville in 91. I was hoping for heaven, but I met the devil's son. David Allen Coe was right. <laughs> About a long, hard ride. You ought to see that little red truck I drive. <laughs> well, I refuse to be something I'm not. So I didn't make the music city news a lot. But I don't give a damn about that now. Because some people like the way I sound. Yes, Sam. Things are fixing to get real good in the honky tonk. I'm understood. I've been to the school of hard knocks and hard wood and things are fixing to get real good. Yeah. women and dreams while we were searching for a sound but we sank right down the musical tubes getting lost in that big crowd and drinking way too much booze lord knows i've done a lot of things wrong but i wrote them all down in my my god country songs sometimes we gotta go to hell and back just to know where we're at everybody sawdust and hardwood don't you know brother but you gotta keep believing that things are fixing to get real Double D on the Firehouse Saloon YouTube channel and live from the Firehouse Saloon Badlands Radio Studio. Things are fixing to get real good, right, brother? Amen, brother. We're going to do it in 2016. I know you always got new stuff. I look forward to it. Hey, feels like home. You know that one? Yeah, playing the shit out of it. <laughs> playing the shit out of it. You can say that. Thank you. We can say that. We can say that. Hey, don't freak out. Thank you, don't, man. Don't it feels like home is one of my very special to me. It, it, it's, it's a song about, uh, you know, you can, a lot of songs I write are have spiritual uh, overtones, you know, lying in there. And, uh, you know, I was, we've all been broken at times, and thank God, you know, we reach out our hand, and there he is. Pulls you back up and keep going. Come on, son. Just keep walking. So uh, that's what that song's about. Tonight. Legendary Firehouse Loon feels like home, don't it, brother? Yes, sir, it does. Let's go Amen. do it. Let's do it. Double D, Daryl Dodd, thank you, man. Thank you, Hank. Till next you. time.